editing and whatnot because I don't have the software or really the technology to do so. But I can say for a fact, this is quieter and better performance than that thing right there. Also, there's my video card. But yeah, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to unbox this, put it on there, and then uh, probably put the motherboard back into the system off camera because this is quite a, uh, <laughs> quite a mess. And then I'll show off what it looks like after the fact. So I'm going to get the tripod and we'll get into the unboxing. So I'm going to apologize if the camera like shakes or goes in and out of focus. I'm still learning how to use this phone. It's a uh, Samsung Galaxy S20 Ultra 5G. It does 4K, 8K, um, and I don't know how to turn off the autofocus thing. It's probably not bad that it has it. I just don't know if it would be distracting or not. This is also a live unboxing. Um, so what do we have here? We have... A uh, Be Quiet Silent Wings um, 135 millimeter 1400 RPM fan. Man, that thing feels great and that's going to move a lot of air. Completely sleeved cable so you don't have the ketchup and mustard right there. There's absolutely zero. Actually, that's a lie. I was going to say there's zero ketchup and mustard in my build. But the stupid HD audio cable has uh, some of those condiments on there. So we got a thing here. I'm going to try to keep this all like in frame because I don't... Are these all the same? I wonder if these are different languages. <laughs> and it doesn't say what the language is on the front. Oh, I assume the top one was English. I, I guess that's the mounting hardware. So yeah, we have all these pamphlets. And I'm going to assume... Yes, this one's English. So, all the rest can be thrown away. We have... Quite the undertaking, I suppose. <clears throat> We're looking for AM4 because I'm using Ryzen like a scrub uh do 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 two long amd mounting brackets a cooler mounting bridge four amd spacer nuts um mounting bridge fastening screws amd backplate screws um thermal paste Oh boy. Okay. This is going to be interesting. I've never really installed a cooler of this magnitude before. Actually, the only coolers I've ever installed are stock coolers. That's it for that. Do they give me a screwdriver? I certainly hope so. I don't think I have a screwdriver long enough. So we have these. For the fan there's enough for two fans but we only have one fan I'm gonna set those off to the side got this bag of hardware which thankfully be quiet is uh, smart enough to uh, label them oh 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 wait I have two random screws I don't know what those are so this says Intel, but that's inside of a different bag. I'm guessing that's the Intel backplate. I'm going to set that off to the side. We got AMD. What do we have here? Oh, look at that <laughs> cute little uh, thermal paste. They said this is enough for two one to two applications I'm not going to be using that no. I have my own Arctic MX4 so yeah that's the other bracket 
I'm guessing these two screws go into that. I could be guessing wrong. I don't know. I'm kind of going by the instructions, but not really. There's the top foam. Oh yeah, look at that. Look at that Dark Rock 4. Now, this is the fan side. I guess, peel off before use. I guess you can make each, like any side, the fan side. But I'm gonna make the boring flat one the fan side. Oh wait, actually this has like anti-vibration fan mounts on it, so and peel that off. Look at that finish. Oh yeah. And I've seen something. Yeah, I'm gonna set that there. Look at that. My very own Be Quiet branded long magnetic Phillips driver isn't that lovely they thought of everything I mean this was oh how much did this cost me uh, I don't remember off the top of my head I want to say it was like $50 50 to $70 it's somewhere in that price point I don't know if I have to take my RAM out um, I do know that I need Put my back plate back on. Just like that. And now, let's get my thermal paste ready. Now, we have. Oh, let's see, what does this say? Uh, do, 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 do. That shows putting it on the VRM side. So, what I need to do is, and I'm sorry if the audio is bad. I'm kind of just winging this video. Oh, there's a lot in here. I'm seeing like washers and O-rings. Um, let's see. An AM3, use the AM3 washers, which is 18. Okay, I don't need, I don't need the little baby washers. That's good. That's good. I have like screws all over the place. So, I need to put one of these. Should I zoom you guys in? Ooh. I don't want to, like, drop my expensive new phone. I got to put one of these on each. Do they only go one way? They do only go one way. Cool. All right. And then, I take one of these, and, you know, let's get the small iFixit screwdriver for this part. I just dropped a screw on my motherboard. Don't look. Okay? Don't look. It's bad luck. That's the wrong screwdriver. I don't know what I'm doing. You see? What am I doing?
There we go, that was easy. I swear. Oh, those are heavy screws. I shouldn't do that. I swear to you, I am a professional. Is this going to interfere with my VRM heatsink or my RAM? I don't know. I just don't know. I don't even know if what I'm doing is correct. I'm following the pictures. That's about all I can do, really. Oh boy. I mean, what more could you ask for? In all honesty. Alright, well that's on there. So now... Uh, do I put the fan on? Before the cool man, that thing is massive. And then this thing goes in there. Yeah, okay. Okay. Uh, where did I put those two screws? There they are. Let's get a shot of Arctic MX-4. You want a pea-sized amount. No more, no less. Don't use the X, don't use the grain of rice. You want... a pea-sized amount right smack dab in the middle. Just like that. Cool. I have a feeling I want to put this on before the fan. Just in case of clearance issues. Okay. Looks like that's on. And now I can do these a little bit at a time. Get that one down. I see why they gave me a long screwdriver. Get that one a little bit on each side. I don't want to crack the IHS. It's not like I'm putting it on a bare die. So I don't have to worry about that. That felt tight. That felt tight. Ladies and gentlemen, I think we got it. So now comes the fan. Uh, this is a silent wings. Let me rotate you guys a little bit actually. Maybe you can see a little bit better now when I go to put the fan on. Let's see. Is that better? Let's scooch up a little bit too. Something like that. I don't know, this tripod's not made for this phone. So... Yeah, I'm kinda... Kinda sketch. See, you can tell I'm like super professional. It's very important, the Be Quiet logo is standing up. In order to ensure optimal airflow. All right. So, 
How do we do this clip thing? I've never done the clip system. Like I said, I've never actually installed a cooler that's not like a stock cooler. So... Those just go in the holes. I assume. I kind of quit looking at the instructions. I'm not going to lie. Get in the hole. Got it. Okay, so now... Looks like we do have RAM clearance, boys. But now comes the question of questions. Is how do I get this on there? Okay, I got one. That, I'm gonna show you in a minute. That's sitting danger close to the RAM. Like, I'm talking danger close. I feel like I'm gonna break it. But I got it. That fan's not going anywhere. So, let's route this cable. Oh boy. Let's route this cable underneath. Hide it from view. To the other side. And it'll go right there. Oh, I plugged it in the. <laughs> I plugged it on wrong twice. Oh. Wait a minute. No, I had it right. I'm just not that smart. Yeah, I'm just not that smart. Don't worry about it. So, I'm going to pause. Okay, so here we are, back handheld. <laughs> Look at that RAM clearance right there. So yeah, I just have the cable routed underneath and I put it in that one first and it looked like it wasn't right so then I put it in this one that's the right one I think yeah CPU fan so yeah size comparison um something tells me this one will be better and also my case has the the pure wings the pure wings twos this is the silent wings so yeah i'm gonna throw this back in there off camera and then come back with the tripod or just a handhold and show you what it looks like in the system and it should be all good okay so there it is in the final build and oh And there it is. Do we get a post? Do we get a post? Hey, we got post. Sweet. Listen to that. I mean, yeah, you can hear it, but it's nowhere near as loud as that thing. Oh, look at that. I got two fans here. And it's just sucking air. So, that's my Be Quiet Dark Rock 4 unboxing and installation video. 
Hopefully you enjoyed. Thanks again, and I'll see you in another video.